Now, your flash briefing from Channel 3 Eyewitness News. It is Sunday, June 14th. I'm Caitlin Nuclo. More peaceful protests are planned around our state today against racial injustice. It comes almost three weeks after George Floyd was killed by police in Minneapolis. Protests are set to take place in South Windsor, Woodstock, East Haven, Norwich, and several other communities. You can find out more information about it on the Channel 3 app. And firefighters from Shelton and surrounding towns were on the scene of a massive fire at the Old Star Pin Factory on Canal Street for more than 12 hours after it began last night. More than 170 firefighters responded after 7 o'clock. The buildings are vacant, but they are not far from nearby residential buildings. Town leaders, DEEP, and the EPA were still at the scene this morning evaluating the impacts of that fire. And the latest numbers released by the governor's office show a record number of COVID-19 tests done in one day. Nearly 14,000 more people have been tested, and there are 305 confirmed new cases of COVID-19 in our state. Sadly, 27 more people have passed away, and there are 11 fewer people in the hospital today. All right, well, we're in for a beautiful day. We'll have partly sunny skies today, low humidity, a lighter breeze. And temperatures today will top off in the lower half of the 70s again. We've got Hartford pegged at 74 degrees, 73 in New Haven, 72 in New London. And this is after we saw record cold at Windsor Locks. We had a tie anyway at 45 degrees unofficially of what was a record that was set back in 1978 or 1979. So... Uh, that is notable that you can get that warm in June thanks just to the sun shining. Then as we look towards tonight, we're expecting to see another chilly night. Not quite as cold, but still cool enough. Upper 40s and lower 50s will be common across the area. Then in your early morning seven-day forecast, we have a string of wonderful days after that. Monday, I think we'll see temperatures in the mid-70s along the shoreline. Inland will be up to about 78. Then Tuesday and Wednesday, both with partly sunny skies and low humidity. We'll have highs 70 to 70, I'm mean, sorry, 75 to 80. And then Thursday, too, looks nice, 76 to 82 with partly sunny skies.